Alright ladies and gentlemen kama kawaida karibu sana katika mzao wa Kibao TV. Of course naitwa Andika Kalambada. Siku leo niko na jamaa ambayo uh, anajaribu sana kufanya mapinduzi ama kuleta vitu ambavyo havijakuwa sana katika industry ya Kenya. Of course uh, tume enjoy music, music zimekuwa hapo awali sawa. Na kuna sekta ambayo inaitwa film and uh, likes production ma movies sawa uh, tukiongelea Kenyan industry kidogo imekuwa chini sana okay but for the past few years eh, uh, tumeweza kuona kwamba kuna wasanii ambao wanakuja wanahakikisha tu kwamba the film industry Kenya inaweza ku grow amna tuna, tuna na the creativity ambao wanaanza kuleta i'm talking about V the one ni jamaa ambayo uh, for now ana atakuwa na premium movie hatari sana ambayo inaitwa Guns and Crosses of course uh, tarehe 15th pale uh, Nairobi Cinema of course uh, before atuambie what do we expect there of course trailer imetoka na trailer is amazing sana kama unapenda action movie of course he ni ya kwetu sio ya amerikani sio ya nchi nyingine but ni ya kwetu of course hatuna kuwa na budi ila ku support kama kawaida we drive in to talk kidogo tujue labda mbona guns and crosses sawa so, ukisikiza okay, okay, laki duba anasema guns and crosses bro karibu sana asante kwa salama niko salama mm. we the one tunakujua kama mwimbaji mbona umeingia kwenye movie um, watu wengi wananijua kama msanii wa mziki lakini uh, nimekuwa I've been an actor since 2010 ndo nilianza acting uh, in 2017 2015 2017 uh, nikaingia shule pale Zitek University I did a course in um, TV production and um, from there nikaamua sasa kuingia kwa production of film I've been, uh, I've been a director and script writer uh, from 2017 but uh, haikukuwa my own personal projects i think no mana watu wengi hawako wananijua kama kama an actor or a producer yeah but uh, i decided to to shift gears from music to film and uh, from last year nikaamua sasa i officially stay kwa kwa film yeah. kuna kitu ambao unajua watu wengi labda hawajui wewe pia ni evangelist labda how are you mixing hizo vitu zote kwa pamoja Uh, I'm actually an ordained apostle. Uh, it is a calling I received since I was very young. And uh, balancing balancing ni ni wewe mwenyewe tu. Uh, kujua when to do what and when not to do what. So uh, ata Bible inasema kuna 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 wale walipatiwa talents tatu, kuna wale walipatiwa mbili, kuna wale walipatiwa moja. Kwa hivyo it's all about managing yourself kujua nini nafaa kufanya sangapi na nini sifai kufanya sangapi. Yeah. Now to the main thing ambayo imetuleta hapa guns and crosses. Mbona guns and crosses? <laughs> guns and crosses. Um I, I I got that name kwa sababu ya the theme, the theme ambayo iko kwa kwa the movie. Uh, and um it was um the film is ba- based on uh, an option uh, kuna vijana wako wako stuck between two options it's either the gun ama a cross on your grave so that's why guns and crosses yeah so ni decisions to the life it, it talks about the decisions of life talks about greed na na vitu kama hizo sometimes if you ukiamua ni bunduki msalaba inakongoja kwa kaburi yeah because at the end of the day kuna tu wanasema something must kill a man okay amari bunduki of course the crosses ta kufata <laughs> amazing sana so bro of course film industry hapa Kenya uh, for years uh, imekuwa chini sana because wana like support sana wanaitwa ma, mashabiki tumeza tu kupeana kwa wasanii ambao wanaimba film kidogo tumekuwa tuki consume tu za Nigeria za Tanzania na za Marekani what do you think kwa guns and crosses uh, italeta ama itafanya sisi wa Kenya to watch guns and crosses um, the diversity in guns and crosses the creativity behind guns and crosses um, the, the level of uh, maturity we've brought uh, in the project i think it will a whole lot of, di- of difference and um, the kenyan market should understand um, uh, the kenyan viewers should understand that uh, we are growing as an industry 
so wametuzoea tu na comedies some dramas but we can also touch on some other different things kwa sababu pia technology imekaa imetusaidia ku, ku, kufanya some few stuff and uh, people like us we, we we've decided to take the risk and uh, do things like action movies vitu watu wa expect Kenya tunaweza fanya so they should expect a lot of creativity uh, behind the project yeah uh, nimepata nafasi ya kuangalia trailer of course it's amazing sana one minute trailer but it's amazing and as a fanya like i just see zinapenda ma action movies i think my boys wengi wanapenda action but ukienda kwa movie shop na tafuta tuile ya, ya mandondi na, na bunduki sawa so right now uh, tumeona pale kuna guns labda uh, serikali iliwapeleka vikoze ukitumia uh, staffs kama guns mazeo na zashikwa uh, ni kujipanga alafu uh, kuna the necessary bodies that you're supposed to to visit like KFCB and uh, you get approval from them wanakupatia certificate ya ku ya ku ya ku allow ku shoot and um, after hapo uko allowed kwa hivyo uh, wasanii wasikuwa wanatafuta shortcuts hizi vitu zinapatikana kuna props ambazo ziko licensed kwa hivyo ni kutafuta tu wale watu wenye wanapeana hizo props ambazo ni licensed alafu wewe pia kama producer take the initiative enda tafuta license ya kushoot hakuna mtu atakusumbua yeah uandishi uh, ilichukua how long uandishi ulinichukua 3 months yes uh, from february to april ndio nimekuwa nikiandika eh, kwa sababu um, Siko nataka ku, ku rush into production i needed the best out of this project na ndio maana hapo awali nimesema uh, watu they should expect a lot of creativity a lot of uh, amazing things in this project because it took time the whole project i think took us around 7 months to prepare yeah including production yeah including production the main production took i think 4 months uh, the preparation the pre-production the planning and then uh, shooting tool uh, we, 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 we did like a month of shooting yeah nikiangalia trailer naona tu ni mtaa ambayo i think watu ambao umetembea mtaa unaweza ona locations ambayo unasema like i know this place labda kuna different places labda umesafiri nje Nairobi kwenda ku shoot um atu kwenda nje Nairobi uh, i think the farthest tulienda ni Ngong kwa sababu kuna scenes tume shoot Ngong Forest Uh, na maeneo ya Ngong Town um, I think that that's the farthest we've gone but even within there are so many locations tunaweza tukatumia unajua mara nyingi when people come up uh, with uh, with scripts hata kitu ina limit a lot of producers and a lot of uh, script writers out there ni a location ya the locations so if if you're creative enough unaweza tumia mahali watu tu wamezoea and make it look incredible Uh, kwa sababu uh, i am sure enough after we've premiered the movie tutatoa the behind the scenes kuna some scenes utaona on the actual movie ukiziangalia on the behind the scenes au utakubali ni the same place yeah because we we use small places and and turn them to be big places yeah so it's just the creativity behind it and the team the production team i worked with was really amazing on um, creating these places and making them amazing yeah Now I think uh, kitu ambayo watu wengi wanasubiri sana ni the premium date ambayo ni 15th of this month that's October of course uh, uh, ni pale Nairobi cinema itakuwa inaanza saa kumi hadi sinaona ni 6 eh, kwenye poster hapo actually uh, the red carpet starts at 4 we have a lot of uh, friends coming in a lot of uh, celebrities coming so tutakuwa na two hours of red carpet so interviews and all that Uh, mingling and everything and then the official screening will begin at 6 pm so the film is 1 hour 50 minutes so probably that's around 8ish do the movie takwa inisha yeah what next after that uh, amazing stuff after this this is just the beginning um after he i think uh, by february next year we'll be beginning another production for another film i won't mention the name right now uh, not to spoil but uh, god willing by february tutakuwa tunafanya another project yes yeah wewe kama msanii wa nyimbo of course uh, wakati unaingia studio na tuangoma already uko na zile platforms unajua so, like ingo yangu nikitoa nitaweka kama youtube space kama flani now guns and crosses uh, watu ambao wataweza kufika pale Nairobi cinema on 15th uh, ama mtu ambaye atataka ku rewatch ata rewatch watu um right now we're still working with um bado tuna tunaangalia where to actually place it 
Uh, so I won't say as per now lakini kuna stakeholders ambao uh, wame reach out already ambao wanataka kufanya uh, simultaneous uh, release so we are just looking at offers unajua mwisho siku we spent a lot of money uh, on the production so hatuwezi achilia tu for the sake ya kuiachilia so tunaangalia nani atatupatia the best deal to 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 to, to upload it alafu from hapo uh tutajua what to do but uh, uh kwa wale waje subscribe to our youtube channel they should do that uh v the one on youtube uh kwa sababu probably we might even decide to post it there yeah kwa hivyo uh, but we are still weighing options uh, we still have a week kwa hivyo within this week tutakuwa tunajua by the time tuna release tuna release on sunday by monday tutakuwa tunajua tunaiweka wapi yes aja tumeona producers ama uh, movies mengi zimetoka hapa nchini na moja unapata like inakuja inafanya vizuri then baadaye team inaharibika hawatoi production tena kitu gani itafanya we crew yako mta stay together na vile umesema by next year mtakuwa na another production and tunaanza kuwa na labda by the end of next year tena tuone another production kigani itafanya like nyinyi mzidi kukapa moja kwa shetu kwamba team yenu ume grow na ile talent ambayo mnataka kupush ume push pamoja um the different thing with us kama v the one creation is that we are a family So uh ata what people should come and expect greatness from from new talents. Kusababu most of the times what on afikiria maybe going for the big names ndo italeta a difference in a project. Lakini sisi tumechukua mabeshte most of them are just friends family ambao we know they are talented some of us didn't get the chance to ku, be featured in some projects maybe to mend auditions but we've never gotten the chance so tumeamua ku create our own group so that we grow together na everybody is hungry for that growth so hiyo hunger ndo ina to keep pamoja uh, this is not the first project already uh, last year peke yake we did i think seven projects we did two feature films and uh, around uh, four ama five other projects ambazo zilikuwa short movies so it's a team that is growing we are hungry for the growth we are hungry for the change in the industry and that is our strength right now yes Uh, thanks so much for your time of course before uh, we end our interview right now what do you have to say to your fans or whoever is watching of course najua uh, ukisema movie like i said guys trailer ni kali so kama uja check you unaweza check so kuwe convinced kwamba whatever we are waiting for itakuwa kali zaidi okay kwa mtu ambaye labda hajapata nafasi ya kuangalia the trailer ama angependa kukua pale ama angependa kuangalia the movie itself eh? ungependa kuambia nini um The trailer is on our YouTube platform um V the one on YouTube uh wakiingia hapo they will watch the trailer please subscribe to our YouTube channel help, help us grow alafu um the premiere will be on the 15th that's next weekend on Sunday from 4 pm uh, kwa hivyo tunawakaribisha uh, wakuje waangalie sinema charges are only 500 shillings um we decided to make it very cheap so that it can be affordable to everyone kwa hivyo uh kwa wale wata watch trailer there is a till number on the trailer uh unalipa tu na mpesa alafu unakuja na Nairobi cinema kama hauwezi lipa kwa mpesa just come with your money you pay the ticket at the entrance na itakuwa available come let's have fun together let's watch this amazing project and it is wo- worth your time it is worth a while yes all the best thank you very much So ladies and gentlemen of course to kutane 15th pale na Robisena maita kwa amazing sana and of course to the beautiful ladies of course hapa tuko Denise Beauty Hub iko pale Arambe Sako of course uh, kama unataka mani kiwa pedikiwa and of course tikons gel and whatever wanakuja hapa Denise Beauty Hub alafu kucha zako na urembo of course wanasema mpaka miguu itakuwa iko sorted so guys tuko Arambe Sako inaitwa Denise Beauty Hub tukutane 15th Nairobi Cinema Thank you guys.